sells Lamborghinis for Bitcoin to help gilded cryptocurrency generation spend its windfall. The cryptocurrency boom is creating a new gilded generation of super wealthy who were savvy enough to snap up Bitcoin early on. Now these fortunate sons and daughters of the virtual currency age are faced with a gigantic, unsympathetic problem, how to spend their wealth. Enter Moonlimbos. The London-based service has connected with auto dealers in the US and Europe to sell Lamborghinis for Bitcoin and Ethereum. For those who did not jump into the Bitcoin frenzy early enough, it may be disheartening to see that a Lamborghini Gallardo LP574 Superlegro Coupe costs a mere 9.72 Bitcoin, or $170,000. Moonlambo's co-founder Ivan Soto Wright says he sees the service as a first step toward offering much larger range of e-commerce options to this new class of consumers. I know a lot of traders who got in early and a lot of them are really concerned about how to liquidate that, he said. We want to facilitate a solution to a key problem, which is how do you spend it. Moonlimbos is a new project recently launched by a larger initiative called HODL. Soto Wright explained that HODL is trying to take a more holistic approach to the cryptocurrency ecosystem by creating a VC fund and launching its own altcoin currency. It's also developing a new virtual currency wallet called Apollo. But along the way, Soto Wright said he started hearing more and more questions about how to convert virtual currency into real-world assets. Anyone who comes into sudden wealth faces a host of challenges in terms of how to spend or save or diversify their fortune. But holders of virtual currency face a couple of particular twists. First, the run-up in the price of Bitcoin has raced far ahead of its utility in the real world. While there's been a steady expansion in the number of merchants who accept Bitcoin and other virtual currencies, the number remains limited. And second, while no one can say for sure whether Bitcoin is really in a speculative bubble, any financial advisor would recommend liquidating at least some portion of those Bitcoins to hedge against any crash. While Soto Wright is interested in that larger e-commerce opportunity for virtual currencies, as a starting point he noticed that two of the most common phrases used in various crypto chat rooms were going to the moon and Lamborghini. Thus, moon limbos. Though the moon trips remain unlikely for now. He also recognizes there will be a certain amusement factor for the general public by using Lamborghinis to solve this new problem of the super rich. It's kind of a fun project he said. It puts a smile on people's faces. In keeping with that spirit, the team decided to promote Moonlimbos this week by borrowing two Lamborghinis, renting some Star Wars costumes, and crashed the London premiere of The Last Jedi. But the overall thrust of HODL is a serious one as it continues to focus on VC investments and expanding into new crypto products. In addition, early next year, Moonlimbos will hold a blockchain initial Lambo offering or ILO. Like an initial coin offering, this fundraiser will give away a 25th anniversary Lamborghini Contouch to one lucky investor. And the rest of the non-Bitcoin holding world will continue to watch from the sidelines with a mixture of envy and regret.